moving more milk from the farm and into China. Fonterra is hoping to increase production on dairy farms after signing a $555 million deal with a Chinese infant formula company. With more demand on local dairy farms, ECAN has no concerns about the effect an increase in production will have on the environment. We can manage it. There's now limits being set through this framework. So ultimately the whole sector is working to limits. And uh, if we stay within those limits, then those are sustainable limits. So there are uh, improvements in farm practice required to do that, but the industry is certainly aware of that. And it's part of this whole process now that what we're seeing a modern day dairy farm is quite different than a dairy farm of, uh, of a decade or so ago. Latest consent compliance figures from ECAN show 96 farms still need to clean up their act when it comes to environmental practices on the farm. Uh, but where, where we are uh, having problems was in ponding typically, so effluent is being discharged across properties, it's ponding, which suggests that the groundwater is saturated um, and, and that's not a, not a good thing. So. But not all farms are ignoring the rules. 72% of dairy farms have reached full compliance. So I think they, they get the sense that the community really expects that and there is a lot of efforts being done right across the sector as well as within Environment Canterbury for, for that to happen. But it's still a very challenging environment to operate in at times and things do go wrong. Farms are now working within regional frameworks to keep the impact on the environment down. And each farmer or each farm operation will ultimately need to have a farm environment plan if they're running a dairy farm. And that allows the farmer to look at all aspects of their farming operation and go through a process of continuous improvement. And, and we think that that's really the, the way of the future. Measures are being made to have better environmental practices. Uh, effluent uh, systems, um, greater storage, uh, precision uh, irrigation, so only the amount of water is going on to the property that is actually needed. Um, and these things are controlled uh, through telemetry systems now, so there's far greater level of precision coming into our whole farming sector and the dairy sector is no exception to that. A full report of consent compliance will be made before the end of the year. Emma Cropper, CTV News.